Hello! I know it's been forever since I last made a video, but I've been having technical difficulties. Since it's now October and there's both the Supernote competition and Nerimon survey for 2012, I thought it would be a perfect time to make a new video. So I was having a lot of trouble deciding whose team to be on. I adore Daily Grace and Tyler Oakley and watch Wheezy Waiter and Ren Link. But above all else, I'm a huge fangirl, so I have to go with Tyler Oakley for this year. Let's get this super note started. Now that we have that over with, time for the Nerimon YouTube survey. Let's go! Question 1. My name's Tasha, and quite honestly, I never actually found out why I'm named that. And my name is kind of ironic because it means born on Christmas Day, while I'm born in the middle of July. But I remember hearing once that my name was possibly going to be Sophie, which I find just so odd. And for some reason, many people call me Samantha, and I don't know where the heck it comes from. Number two, I've actually had a couple in second grade and in seventh grade, but I have to go with second grade. I don't actually remember much of it, but my teacher's name was Monsieur Bouchard. We used to watch old real film movies with puppets, and I remember doing experiments outside frequently. For instance, once we got a student to use a giant plant leaf as an umbrella, and the classroom had a bunch of fish, and any memory that I have from that time is just positive. Number three, I'm a vegetarian, and for the longest time I was always extremely picky, so the only thing I can think of is maybe a star fruit. I don't even think I've ever tried bacon. <laughs> Number four. I was about 10-ish and exactly on my birthday there was a Nelly Furtado concert that my mom brought me to. We had seats in the balcony for the opening acts, but since most of the main floor was empty, we were able to sneak in and go to the very, very front. But I was wearing heels and a really uncomfortable dress that should have basically only been for a graduation, so I was unprepared for that first concert. More recently, I've been to a couple of YouTube concerts, but I'd say the official first concert that I bought myself was actually just a couple weeks ago. I've become obsessed with Tegan and Sarah, so I jumped at the chance to see them at their first concert of their fall tour for their new album. It was general admission, and I was second in line after waiting from 9.15 a.m. I was even more prepared than some longtime concert goers, so everything couldn't have gone better, and the concert was amazing. I'll put a link to my Tumblr for more posts about it. Number five. In my downtown, there's this beautiful library, and it basically comes the closest to replicating Italian architecture. Whenever I walk by it, I sort of call it a castle. And with at least seven stories, it's book heaven. Last year for Halloween, I got a chance to go after hours and play hide and seek in the whole building. It was so much fun. Plus, a scene from one of my favorite movies, Imaginarium of Dr. Parnassus, was filmed there, so it just makes it even better. Number six. One of my best friends, Gigi, had an interest in starting to vlog, so maybe once she has a channel sorted out, I'll link her below. DFTBA, and hope to see you a little bit sooner than last time.